Welcome back to part 17 of my Ramesses Let's Play, Total War Pharaoh. So, picking things up, we left them last time. We resumed the action following the rather disastrous attempt to siege Menefer. We weren't able to press ahead and strike the settlement itself because Seti appeared and broke the siege and uh, broke my army. Although, thankfully, he didn't wipe out uh, a single unit completely, uh, but we did take... Uh, some rather hefty casualties in places. We're going to pull this army back this to Ayinu, let it replenish for a few turns, and then we'll bring it back alongside Ramesses once he's taken Chem, secured some more bronze production for us, and also secured the Sphinx and the Giza Pyramids. That will give us a bit more legitimacy. Then we'll swing him back and try and strike Menefer. I'm hoping that Seti will um, move back south and try and put some pressure on um Timotep that's, that's charging through his settlements he's going to keep on pushing south uh what I'm going to do this time is if we if we siege with one army we'll have another army supporting probably an ambush stance ready to catch out Seti if he tries to break the siege or reinforce that's going to be the plan we've got um six turns left of this civil war so we obviously want to try and grab as much territory as we can although I highly doubt we can catch up to Talsra at this point 238 he's 90 points ahead of us right now she's just storming ahead but we'll, we'll see how close we can get. Um, still worthwhile us putting the pressure on Seti to do as much damage to him as possible. Uh, how many regions he got? He's got seven left. I don't think we'll quite be able to wipe him out. It's going to take a few turns to hit some of the provincial capitals. And obviously, we'll need to build up siege equipment at Menefer. Uh, even if we've uh, got multiple forces, probably at minimum grab a few rams. Although, I'd probably want some towers as well. So, yeah, we're going to go after these guys. They have got... Where are they? Do, 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 do. Yeah, what's that? They've got the four regions, but their regions are spread out all the way down the Nile. I think it's just this one territory over here, so hopefully they won't be able to react to that. And again, hopefully we'll we'll peace out with them in six turns when the civil war ends. So let's kick things off with some war. In we go. Declare it. I'm doing it. Straight on in. Um, what is the order resolve? saying my chariot is going to take some hefty i think is i've got to try and minimize my casualties here because we want to be able to rapidly redeploy with ramesse so yeah i think we'll we will fight this one but i'm going to come back to it in a second i'm just going to see how timotep fares pushing south I as well for Egypt. can he do that he's going to lose me as well okay so we're gonna to have to fight both of these to prevent some losses again it's the chariots so we'll dive into both these battles. Stop so a battle-focused episode. Let's just do all of our other actions for the turn. And then we'll do those battles. Right, what are we doing? Uh, nothing right now. Uh, oh, I know what I was doing. I was going to come in here to request connections. I then would sooner help a servant of Ra than any gossip. Problems. Gossip. The well educated should Quest always be together. And then. I guess I'm embezzling Seti because I've already got the regard up with him. 40% base chance. Beautiful. And then we can, yeah, boost that straight away. Clearly you recognize my power. Uh, we can even do that again, isn't it? Next turn, because we need. Yeah, 30 regards. So, yeah, we're all sorted with that next turn. And then I could potentially try and plot against to discredit to steal some of her legitimacy. They've got 0% chance because she's just really secure with her with her huge amount of legitimacy that she's got. Yeah. I uh, wonder if you're suggesting like I go for a, I try and go for a higher spot um, here rather than the first commander because. Uh, that will give me more legitimacy. So, like, I could try and uh, plot to... Um, so, the threaten is that. I become the new visit. Yeah. Can't do... I'm assuming I can't do multiple, though, because if I got rid of him with the embezzle, then he wouldn't be a target, right? But that would also give you... Yeah, I would double my legitimacy. I probably shouldn't have targeted him for embezzlement then if that was the case but again grand scheme of things an extra seven i don't think it's going to help us catch up unless she suddenly starts losing a load but i can't see that happening so it's going to be talisman we'll have to go after him primarily i would have thought through just significant conquest is what we're going to have to do uh how are we looking with all our resources um yeah food could do with increasing him just thinking were we doing anything else on this 
trying to remember after the weekend break of recordings. Um, upkeep production for Grand Temple of Ra. Yeah, that'd be nice. But I could get my main settlement to tier three first. Okay, let's get that up there. Then we'll come back and grab the, all the other bits and pieces. Nothing else to do, I'm sure. I can't be right. Um, here, we are saving up to get that. And I need five. So we're still waiting. Oh, but yeah, your growth is crippled because of the death walks land one more turn okay so that'll be fine next turn so ignore that for now uh, out per okay you've already got one of those so economic yep escalon or oh, pell we can get a monument there boom three turns hello buddy um you can have a follower you can have a veteran soldier in you go Nothing else for you right now. Titles. Yeah, we can pop some bits in here. Um, let's go for... Hang on, wait. You're leading... Yeah, that army. So all the replenishment right now is going to go into that. Beautiful. Uh, not there. We're saving. Here. Yeah, we're going for that again. Saving. We need to wait for stuff to come back. Over here. Going for that again. Need to wait for Death not to be stalking the land anymore. Dimotep, you've also gained Against a point. Let's finish off your, your base three. There you go. You've got all of them. Lovely. So, yeah, I can't do anything more with that. Ambitions holds 20 settlements. Okay, we're going to get that soon. That's fine. Right, let's kick things off with Ramesses. In we go. So, yeah, just avoid those chariots struggling. Let's do it. Of course, as always, thanks for your comments, advice, tactics, and suggestions. They're all greatly appreciated. Do keep them coming, as well as the unit suggestions over on part one of this series. I think I saw quite a few more posts over the weekend, so hopefully this week I will add in, at long last, the names for Timotep's army. Um, but kind of like ding, 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 last call for adding those in. Also, now the game's out. Any of you um, dabbling with a few mods that have been released so far? Let me know if you think there's any good ones that can be added mid-campaign. Let me know. Okay, they're coming in over there, so Let's deal with them. Some pressure on them with the chariots. It's just this point here, so we'll spread our forces out a little bit and we can look to always reinforce and intercept over there. I will take Ramesses with his royal bodyguard. Why don't they fight us like have my chargers over here. With the archers. Potentially have this infantry here. In pursuit of glory. Okay, in they come. What I want to try and do is get in between them and the settlement. So they're forced to engage with these guys because then they're pinned. And then my chariots can charge on in. You can see all of their slingers at the back there. You guys keep going. You have some slingers there, but nothing crazy. Get ready. Because the last thing you want is those forces getting into the settlement. Yeah, pull across over there. It's looking good. Right. Move two of them up round behind and have you charge in now. Oh, I'm going to have them charge. Keep them pinned. Keep them in place. Archers, move on that position. After me, brothers. Chariots, get going. Here we go. Right. Turn that one around there. They have made a breakthrough with some of them. A lot of them are just trying to pull through and get into the settlement. Born to do battle. You will suffer. Keep going, guys. 
They're flanking me. All for Egypt. Swordsmen. Turn it around. Let's hope this is a substantial charge, which it looks like it is. Peel off that way. Pull them back. In you guys go. Oh, you guys are in trouble. And likewise over here. Forget yeah, they're not in skirmish mode. I'm also not used to the AI actually charging your archers if you start targeting them. Normally they just sit there and take it. So that, that's kind of nice. So my Medjai are holding out for the most part, apart from that unit there, which uh, Sons of Egypt. Strike through. Now they are can't imagine that's a huge amount of fun for them. Behold my greatness. Pull back. Move Soldiers the flanks. Move, move the flanks. Pull it back. We will ride them down. Form it back up. Enter position. We will not falter. I just need these Medjai to hold here, which to they're doing the Swords of O'Connell. All for Egypt. Devastate them. Swordsmen! Let us hope the sand buries our foes. Send them to Another unit in. Javelins over there. Fire on in. Form up here to smack him in the flanks. Yeah, that's what we want to see. Multiple routing forces. Pull it back, get ready to slam again. That chariot just came through as well and smashed on in. Beautiful. They're in. Nearly a full route, just the uh, general that's holding. Keeping busy. War is my calling. Death is your only escape. Keep going, Adam. Yeah, they're going. They're going. The morale drop there. Ooh, yeah, you guys are actually being rather annoying targeting my archers like that. You will know defeat. Clubs. Sons of Egypt. Clubs. Devastate them. Lock in the sky. Marching on. Show strength. Go, 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 go. Chariots, pull it back. Swordsman. Go. Slam. Yeah. Pull it back, guys. Archers, fire there. That one's about to go. Good not to see you badly. There we go. There's the win. Don't need to keep fighting it. Those are in the settlement. I mean, I guess we can get some more XP for our units, but I think we're I think we're fine. We've actually got some pretty decent XP on most of these guys now. I don't want to bring that up. Let's bring that up. Rank seven, yeah. Nice. Job done. Two hundred forty-four lost. Yeah, that's fine. Smushed him. We are warriors without peer. Thanks for all the resources. Thanks for the legitimacy. Established order. Right. What's that done to our legitimacy? I don't know why I'm going there. Or can I can just see it there. 159. Thing is, like, if she was maybe not going to gain any more legitimacy, maybe, just maybe, I could push and grab enough, but. 
feel like yeah it's not gonna it's not gonna do it so we've got the sphinx and the gizpro i'm assuming that replaces the um the regular monument let's make it a regular um, normal monument here as well I mean, I'm going to get rid of the fort. Just upkeep for a few turns. Could go up Destiny there, but then I'd lose stuff. I'd have to move back down here anyway. Yeah, we've got the Sphinx and the Giza Pyramids now. Phenomenal. That uh, are we? Where are we at the moment? We're in crisis. We're not in full collapse. Okay. We're not at war with the things. We're not at war with Taos around. But I mean, I could just jump down and grab like territory from her. All these uh, places over here. There's more bronze actually. You can go even further over here. Actually, didn't realize it extends that far. We could go and grab all of this. We'll wait until the wall's over though. Um, I guess I see people's coming in and harassing those points. So what do we got here, Kem? Uh, workforce growth, and you've got that for bronze income. Um, yes, yeah, so we've lessened it a bit. Uh, we can get rid of... Uh, I think the happiness will be fine, although we'd have to go after these ones from Talsat. I mean, we could try and grab those from her. But six turns of Menifer. Anyone else want to join in the last minute? <laughs> I doubt it. Doubt it. That's going to think it's, it's going to take such a huge amount of legitimacy to declare kick off because civil war. I'll probably be the only one. I would have thought. I don't know how well you handle these. How well the game handles these giants gathering these massive strides um, in game. I don't know what I'm looking at. Um. Yeah, I don't know why I'm looking at those because we've already gone through it for the turn. So yeah, that's over there. Um, we're destroying the fort. And I am going to destroy that happiness one. Yep. Do, do, do. You will Let's die. do second battle. Engage the enemy. And... Oh, wasn't it saying before I was going to lose those chariots? Mm, I think it was actually, wasn't it? Okay, I'm just going to order a with them. We already had a, a battle. Fairly similar to this, so we're not going to be short of battles anytime soon either. They never stood a chance. Kind of just want to push forward the next turn, see kind of what happens. More legitimacy. Nice. Mine now. What I'm hoping is we pull Seti out of here so we can try and knock him out. That'd be very nice. Um, yeah, we've got to get some growth going. Um, but that needs to be at tier three. That's not the problem. Uh, you get rid of that. Your influence is fine here. Workforce growth, happiness. We've only got the one resource building here. And we get something to support, don't you? Okay, so it'll be that one. And then I guess Pups Grow Happiness, Workforce Growth. I'll probably go for those two actually then. Workforce Grow the Beer Hall, yeah. The Irrigation Network. That's fine. Right. Let's end the turn. Are you going to sail up with Seti as well? Strike? Or where are you going? Where are you harassing? You're going to cause some trouble. You're going to hit my outpost, aren't you? Or oh, he's going to go hit my pyramids. He's going to he's going to surely go back there. You're going to march stance. Yeah, and rush back. Not sure why that little army of four has gone out.
My ambition is rewarded. Ambition fulfilled though, our expansion. Lovely. We'll get a new one of those soon. Oh, we don't have vision over his territory anymore. That is something Talk fast. I cannot bear idle gossip. that I want to see. So I'm going to pop that right back in there. I want to see where his forces are. And yeah, you know Speak what? Mind. I want the same your thing for you, Talsarat. Oh, thanks. You're very, you're friendly despite the, <laughs> despite the threat that we pose. Ooh. Oh, my days. Can I, he'll be in force. Ah, oh, he'll, ah, oh, wait, hang on. Proud son of Egypt. Can you come? We draw out the garrison though, wouldn't we? It's going to be basically fully replenished now. I will not submit. I'm thinking I can use this command to attack in force march. I can just reach him. He'll be knackered and tired. We then draw out 14. I fear he nothing. can't run. So if I bring these guys in along the river. Oh, no, I can just... will be legend. I just think I need to kind of deal with that force, but I could bring that other one. Let's see. Can I, can I go into the river and then... I don't think you can strike from the river, can you? Because there's no, like, naval battles in this. We'll bring you guys in as well. Long journey ahead. It's just like happy days, isn't it? Let's do it. Never surrender. Let's do it. Let's get our revenge. The Here we go. Right, let's Egypt. pop this point in for you. Uh, what am I working towards? I was working towards getting that one, which I just popped in already. That's fine. Uh, which of these do we want? Moon restored after battle. That would be nice. I need more of this. That's more more movement. Yeah, right now actually, more movement, please. Chosen of Ra. And I can attack. And I'm assuming that symbol going to a fist means he will reinforce. And he can't run. Are we not put we are putting the garrison? Beautiful. Yeah, actually, and these guys oh no, they they will be tired, but we will be fresh, I think. I'm like, well, well it says tired, but it doesn't actually update for that. Low casualties, apparently this is a smash. Oh no, no, we are losing some units. Some chariots. In that secondary army coming in tired yet, so we will fight it and good. I, I wanted to fight it anyway. Here we go. Clash of pretenders. Clash of crowns. Uh, we will wait. I hope we avoid a sandstorm. Perfect. The reinforcement coming in from behind. So it could be one large force versus one large force. I'll deploy up on the left here. Reinforcements to come in. There he is. I 
Oh, you guys know you're coming in fresh as well. Beautiful. Let's have that command re-enacted. That's good. Chariots. Move over that way. Arches. Actually, I'll have you guys on the flanks as well. And have I got enough groups to pop these guys all in? Oh, no. I forgot about those units of Magi Archers that I've got in as well. Uh, I'm going to have to have you guys as a group. And the Spears as a group. With Timotep in there as well. Noise. Right. Force March. I don't think his reinforcements have come on in yet. I don't, I don't quite get how the reinforcement system in this works because I, I don't know if it's bugged or what. They just don't come in properly. Not all the time, at least. They'll come in as you press the attack to them. I kind of wonder if there's meant to be a similar system like you've got in Warhammer where there's a timer for those reinforcements but it doesn't fire properly. Or they just bug out and they don't come in. The thing is, we want that garrison. We want that garrison to come on in because we want to deal as much damage to them as possible, which will then mean our siege of men of fur is a slam dunk for us. Like we just need some. Uh, we just need a ram, and either we can auto resolve it, or we can fight it, but fairly comfortably. Or if it sometimes bugs out because it doesn't see this, like space for the troops to come in. If you've got another army sat back at their deployment zone or reinforcing zone. Doesn't seem to be a lot of rhyme or reason to it. Pull these guys around. Looking good. Everybody still fresh. Some of them wounded. The spears because they're going to be heavier. At least some of them. Envelop them. I can't really get my chariots into the position I want here, but I can always just charge the line, especially if it's just those archers on the flanks. I think I might nearly be in range of them as well. Something I might try here though, because I've been mean to try it out in the past and not remember to do it. a ground attack on the trees set them on fire and see it spread through the grass as well hopefully we tried it last battle actually didn't we but i don't think the grass was right we're gonna see if with enough concentrated fire we can get the grass to burn tear away this terrain That provides them light cover. Yeah, there we go. Them down. See, firing, firing away pretty aggressively. So I'm going to move you guys forward here. Actually, with all the archers in case it reacts with all of them. Pull them all forward so we can hit their militia. to adjust with those guys there. On the march. 
Spreading? Yeah, it is good. That's that unit sling is just completely gone. It's along here so they can just charge on down. We're just going to go for a massive charge. Well, the thing is, we won't go for a massive charge, but then that won't allow for any of the garrison to come in. Which is what we want. Just going to spread. Yeah, it is good. You guys catch on fire if you go through this? to us now. Feel. Well, that unit getting absolutely ruined. Keep that focus. I fear nothing. Shoot them down. Clots. Devastate them. Go. Yeah, here the reinforcements come, so let the reinforcements come in a little bit more. Then we unleash the chariots. These guys have really gone for it. Looking pretty messy. Push. Go. Go. Here come the chariots. That's the carnage of battle. Yeah. Chariots. A smashing time. Yeah, wreck this garrison. Oh, you guys are instantly pulling back. I think it's the, the guard mode. It's a bit... It seems squiffy. You guys took a bit of a beating there, but... Didn't realise we'd be getting our vengeance on Seti and his forces so swiftly. After last time. Really take these guys off guard mode. Go, 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 go. Shouldn't be a huge amount of garrison left. You guys just go back into this formation. Never seen it before. Like, to all game act like that. Just like, right, okay, we'll reset, we'll go back. I'm like, really? Um. I wonder if it's something to do with the group lock attack as well, actually. So I swear I've seen this happen with um I am invincible. Move us one. The guard mode off as well. I think we're taking out most of them though. Still firing, yep. Yeah. You can turn and fire on Seti. I remember, these guys have got rapid fire as well. Swordsman, see the might of Egypt. Chariots. We munched those guys there. Yeah, we have right. Bring the, bring the chariots up to Garfetti and what he's got left. 
There you go. Quick, 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 quick. He's still in there. Ramesses can actually catch Seti here. Not if you get knocked over by chariots, though. Maybe flanking maneuver. Chase him down. You're getting harassed by these guys, though. The. Uh the wings of Horus, yeah. Come on, get him. We must rest. Break get him. Them. Destiny calls. Charioteers, go! They are too strong! Warrior of fate. He's at the front. Go on, go take him out. Getting closer. Go on. Our might is unassailable. Standard bearer and Seti left. This guy's going for it. Nice. Not enough to finish him, though. Never back down. They never stood a chance. I'm trying. Let's see if we get him with the chariots now. Oh, I definitely knocked Seti down. There we go. Boom. Job done. 203 losses, 141. So the garrison does have 744 remaining, but they had 2,000 deployed. So they took a bit of a pretty big beating there. So we should be able to go through nice and easily. Plus, we know we've knocked out Seti's army, so there shouldn't be another army coming in to reinforce. But Timotep's there to, to defend this anyway. This is my destiny. Glorious. I could take the f nearly like full replenishment. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Actually, 21. percent Let's do it. Destiny calls me. Unfortunately, oh, I can hit with Timotep, which is that's now an order resolve slam dunk. So all I need is the ram in there. I'm not going to fight it. Um, it's because we get all those these guys reinforcing. Uh, it does the job. Nice, 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 nice. Um, so yeah, I mean, we've smashed Thirty's forces there. I might just go after Talcerets once and complete this region, this province here in the next like five turns with Ramesses, go through there and then just keep pushing down against Seti. If we can take his capital and a gem, that'd be great. I mean, if we could get this, this whole region here, that's another bronze production center hub. That one is a cult and that one got raised so if i can get down and grab that that'd be nice might be able to start moving you guys down there what i'm gonna do knock away this army so we don't want to behind our lines march on men finish them off i'm gonna take heavy damage to my archers but that's okay I'm not losing them they never stood a chance Take whatever replenishment we can get. Ever dutiful. Yeah, please repair that. Eager to fight. Ready to Force march. Out, Go here. Gain the stuff back. 
Do that. Gain the money back. <laughs> right, I need to get you. I was kind of hoping I could get you close to the river. That one being, that one that's being built. I could rush it. Do it. In the name of duty. Your upkeep. Reductions here. Head over there. You, you've gained some some worthwhile points there, so that's fine. Resources are we're just swimming in it. Cool actions available. I bid you um, so I need to do that, but I don't need to worry about that just yet. Um, can I can I plot against you? Blackmail. Oh no, it's not one threaten, isn't it? That's what I want. I become the new treasurer. Uh, which wouldn't wouldn't be awful, and it would also not hurt. She'd lose. She'd lose her position. Fourteen legitimacy. I mean, let let's try it because realistically, yeah, I'm gonna assist actually. Then I can just Our threaten away. Um, built on it's probably not going to go through, but also it's. I don't think still we're going to get enough to knock her off because she's at 257 legitimacy. She just keeps on gaining it. She ain't messing. Right, you're now gaining workforce again. That's good. Uh, over here, we can get the bronze workers district, but that needs to be at tier three. So that's what we're going to do. Could chuck some of these things in, so yeah, let's do it. Need more workforce though, didn't think about that. Yeah, Wally. Undo, undo. Return to the start of your turn. <laughs> I mean, that's basically undo turn is basically like load the save, right? <laughs> I don't want to do that because otherwise I'm assuming it means we have to fight those battles again. You guys need to wait. Escalon though can have more production. That increases the recruit rank for everyone here. Uh, that is happiness and influence all around. Uh, that's really, really not a bad thing. I'm just kind of looking at your surrounding influence. It's all good. Probably because of all that. Um, let's get that upgraded first, though. Civilization points. What to be civilization points? Oh, that'll be this, won't it? Yeah. 30, so we can see how many it uh, gives. So yeah, to, you get 10 there, 30, and then 50. So that will knock us, yeah, through crisis still, but that's, that's fine. Yeah, it's been here. Got to repair that. I'm assuming we can't have that because we've already got an, a, mon a monument, which is the pyramids. Though that one gives plus 8, and that one doesn't. Army gains morale for a few more turns. Yeah, I don't understand. Or is it, oh, there's already one over there. No, so you can have two. So you can have. I was thinking otherwise, you'd you'd build the monument over that every time. It's because there's one already over there. You can only have one per province, even if you don't control it, own it, and all that. Uh, toth, 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 toth. Shall we start building up to you? Yeah, let's let's, let's get some toth going on. I haven't done any toth yet. Um, I'm trying to remember, what does your general do? Armor, piercing, more armor, but what's your prayer do? Uh, labor costs. Oh, for sieging. Okay. Oh, so shrines are happiness and construction cost resource management. Is that, that means shrines are all right. We like a shrine. Yeah, that'll sort out our, our happiness or lack of. Imminent Rebellion in Buto. Oh, no. That's annoying. I mean, this one might be able to quickly deal with it. Um, I was waiting here, though, to build that, wasn't I? But, um, are you unhappy? Taxes. You're producing a fair amount of food. I could turn it off. Try and improve it. That all that's affected just taxes, and then we've got other. Uh, then I can't. I need to. I need that to be able to complete this whole thing. That's going to hit our happiness as, as well. 
So yeah, we need we need like a happiness building in here, don't we? Then what I want to do is build that, construct it instantly, and leave you untaxed for another turn or two. We're okay. I mean, we're okay with our generation at the moment, so that's all right. It's all right. To battle, Timotep. Um, I am going to. Go for more movement, I think. Right, let's end the turn. I think we'll wrap things up if we get attacked or when we make it to the next turn. See Town Threats forces here. That's, that's where she is. I'm going to look what she's doing. See what you're doing. That's fine. Fairly uneventful. Siege of Manifair underway. They will bleed. Oh yeah, you we'll need to die. shift your we normal stance. There you go. But that's now a slam dunk. Especially as soon as we've got Ramesses there. Although we could take Ramesses away. And I'm assuming it's still decisive for us. Um, I, I know it'd be nice to see a big city like this um, in action. But with a weakened garrison, there's not much point. So we'll kick things Stop off next time. Probably order cowards. resolving that. We'll send Ramesses. Oh, I can probably yeah, send him over here. We've got to think of a force march there, aren't we? But yeah, I think we'll declare war briefly on Taos right now as well. What's going on here? Plots. Here we are. Oh, there's an unknown the one against me. And I mean, gossip. So I might need to try and do that. But I want to try and improve my threaten. Um, I mean, let's see if this goes up at all. Wow, really? Because she's got so much. Even if I do it again. Wow, it's just impossible because she's just got so much legitimacy. Right she's now nearly 100 points ahead of me. Yeah, so we're not going to knock her off. Um, oh, that's good then. Um, okay, well, next next, um, chem next turn, we will finish off our embezzle and then start gossiping with people, see if we can reveal our own plot and get them to stop. Yikes. Um, yeah, Tim will take that. This army, I'm going to sail on down. See if I can grab this. Um, uh, or just settle down and strike more of Zeti's regions there and then cut across and in. I don't know. Cause I'd, yeah, I don't really want to push from, from this position here. Uh, we've already got a monument there. We've got a fort. I can shuffle some of those things around as well. But yeah, um, if you've got a really strong case as to why you think we should fight this one, then let me know. But... Uh, yeah, failing that, we will open just giving this a nice cheeky order as well, although I may well move Ramesses away first. So yeah, until the next one, I hope you guys have enjoyed. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Take care, and ciao for now.